This is so sad. Would you protect me from an exploding grenade? What? You mean like this guy did? Yeah. If you and I were in the exact same situation, would you do that for me? Of course. Why? To save your life. Mm-hmm. That's all? What? Is that not good enough? No other reason. Oh, because I love you? Idiot. Would you leave me if I got paralyzed? No. Thought so. Yeah, but we are married. You know, till that do us apart? I'm not talking death. It's not the same thing as being paralyzed. I'll still stay with you. Why? Mm, because you're an idiot. And you need me. All right, that's good enough for me. I love you. Yep, you're the idiot. <laughs> Excuse me, who are you? Oh, hey there, I'm Trevor. I'm not sure if you're lost, but this is my condo. I just got the keys today. Oh no, I'm not lost. I'm in your roommate. Um, no, I just bought this place. Exactly, and I come with it. There must be some sort of mistake. See, this condo is mine. I've just signed the contracts. No, there is no mistake. The thieving pastor foreclosed on me, so in protest, I'm not going to leave. Okay, you don't seem to get it. See, this isn't your place anymore, it's mine. Nowhere in the contract does it say that it comes with an extra person. See, that's just like them. They don't tell you everything before you buy. Personally, I don't think it's fair. But hey, what can you do? Well, I can have you forcibly removed from my home for one. Now, why would you go and do that? I told them straight away that I wasn't going to leave. But they give you the keys anyway. Did they mention I'll be here? Well, no, but... See, they're all liars. They knew very well that I'll be here when you got here, but they give you the keys anyway. What if I was a serial killer or something? Are you? Am I what? A serial killer. God, no. I won't hurt a living thing until you piss me off. Maybe I'll consider it. Oh, the goulash. I think it's almost ready. I think you'll love it. I'll be right back. Casey, is everything okay? Mike, do you love me? Of course I do. Why would you ask me something like that? Well, it's just things that have been different lately. You are away more often and I... I get lonely. Oh God, are you cheating on me? No, I'm not cheating on you. Casey, w what is it? Well, I need to know where we are. You mean as, are we gonna go any further with this? You know I love you, right? I know, it's just, you've been away in trips and in different cities and home only for a short amount of time. If you're worried whether I'm cheating on you or not, you have nothing to worry about. That's not it. Well, then what is it? Do you ever want a family? Well, yeah. Eventually. I always picture myself with a wife and a family. And I'm working really hard to make that happen. Are you pregnant? Casey, are you pregnant? It's something I need to tell you. When I was 18, I had a boyfriend. We were young and stupid and I got pregnant. My parents forced me to have an abortion telling me I was way too young to have a kid and that I will thank them one day for it. Casey, I'm not gonna judge your past. Everyone makes mistakes when they're young. It happens. You don't get it. Something went wrong during the procedure. The hospital told me it was a very serious abnormality in my uterus. I think the doctor was drunk or something. What did he do to you? I can't have children ever again.
Mike. Mike. Give me a second. 